News Army. Without the gas cap, the European Union will experience terrible winters. As a result of rising natural gas prices, the Belgian Minister of Energy has warned that EU countries could experience 5 to 10 terrible winters if nothing is done. Demands are growing for a gas price cap across the European Union and for gas to be uncoupled from electricity costs. Since Russia's invasion of Ukraine in February triggered sanctions, EU states have been struggling with massive increases in the cost of energy. However, Germany claims it is restocking its gas reserves sooner than anticipated. The Western countries that support Ukraine are attempting to reduce their dependence on Russian natural gas and oil. Russia, which supplied 40% of the EU's gas last year, has responded by cutting off deliveries. Earlier today, Belgian energy minister Tin van der Streeten tweeted that freezing European gas prices was an urgent priority and that the current link between gas and electricity prices was artificial and should be reformed. Unless we take action, the next 5 to 10 winters will be extremely harsh, she warned. Gas prices need to be frozen immediately, and Europe is the place to do that. Electricity costs in Europe have also skyrocketed, hitting a new high this week. To produce electricity, gas is widely used. On Friday, the price of electricity under a contract for one year's use in Germany hit 995 euros, 844 pounds, 991 dollars, and in France, it hit 1,130 euros. According to AFP, this is an increase of more than 10 times from the previous year across both countries. We have to stop this madness that is happening right now on energy markets, said Austria's Chancellor Karl Niehammer. He also urged the EU to separate electricity and gas prices to bring down the cost of electricity for consumers. He said it is unacceptable to let Russian President Vladimir Putin unilaterally set the daily electricity rate in Europe. Do you think the world could survive without Russian oil and gas? Despite Russia reducing deliveries, Germany, the largest importer of Russian gas in 2020, has been scrambling to build up its gas reserves in time for winter. To reach their goal of 85% gas capacity by October, they must fill the rest of the tanks. It has done this by instituting energy-saving measures. According to economy minister Robert Habeck, Germany was able to reach its target earlier than expected thanks to these measures and the purchase of gas from alternative suppliers. He thought it was possible to hit 85% by the beginning of September.